When Face ID stopped working or set up Face ID turned gray cannot be triggered. How can we fix problems like this? First of all, we need a key on the data programmer on Copy Plus. Connect the activation board to the programmer and turn it on. On the host computer, double-click the software icon to open it. At the top left part of the software interface, choose Lattice Meaning Face ID Repair. Now the device status says disconnected. Connect the host computer to the programmer. Here it shows device connected. Buckle on the defective dot projector to the activation board. Click detect chip. Then we could see the detected result here. Please be aware that if it shows luminescence anomalies, but the IC data says normal. In this case, it cannot be activated. It only works when the IC data says is fusing. Besides, it cannot be activated when IIC says IIC breaking. Next, we need to back up the data of the defective dot projector. Click Cloud Backup. If it says failed to obtain the SN number of the mobile device, please insert your device, meaning you didn't connect the phone to the computer. In most situations, the defective phone needs to be connected to the host computer at the same time. After connecting the phone to the host computer, it will show serial no and phone type here on the software interface. Now it's finally time to cloud backup data. Wait in patience until the data of the dot projector has been backed up. Now it's time to move forward, which is to activation, meaning the programmer is now activating the dot projector. But if it says high pressure detection is abnormal, means the activation board hasn't connected to the 19 volts power adapter. So we will have to connect the power adapter to the board. Click activation again and wait for it to process. After the activation is done, prepare a brand new dot projector repair flex. Buckle on the flex to the activation board. Click cloud burning. Here we choose the data we backed up earlier. Click burn and wait for it to complete. When it says data transmitted and write in, success. Take off the flex. At last, fold the flex according to the iPhone model. Flex folding instructions for iPhone X. Flex folding instructions for iPhone XS. Flex folding instructions for iPhone XR. Flex folding instructions for iPhone XS Max. Flex folding instructions for iPhone 11. Flex folding instructions for iPhone 11 Pro. Flex folding instructions for iPhone 11 Pro Max. Flex folding instructions for iPhone 12 to 12 Pro. Flex folding instructions for iPhone 12 to 12 Pro. Flex folding instructions for iPhone 12 mini. Flex folding instructions for iPhone 12 Pro Max.